Good morning, Connecticut. I'm Sarah Cody. It's Sunday, January 31st. Thank you so much for joining us. We will get to all of those top stories in just a moment. But first, meteorologist Ashley Baylor is here with our local forecast first, which is a busy, complicated forecast. We got a storm on the way. That was LaSalle Blanks reporting. Now, this clinic is open Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 4, and on weekends from 8 a.m. to noon by appointment only. As for the Waterbury Health Clinics that were temporarily shut down, they are getting a new shipment of the vaccine on Tuesday morning and hope to have those back open Tuesday afternoon. And we have plenty more ahead for us in sports this morning with Eric Dobrats. It was a busy weekend on hockey rinks all around the state. Take care. Eric, thank you. All right, Ashley, once again, you need to inform me about the Royal Rumble that's coming oh up tonight. Boy, even the way you said it. <laughs> the Royal Rumble. It's How did I Royal say Rumble. it? All it's right. the Royal yes. Rumble. It's the Royal Rumble. We live in New England, Ash. We can take it. I thank think we you. can handle it. All right. A stunning new projection about the death toll from the coronavirus. According to the University of Washington's pandemic forecasting team, even in a best case scenario, nearly 200,000 Americans are likely to die between now and May 1st. This as new variants of the virus emerge and vaccination efforts continue with mixed results. ABC's Karina Mitchell has more. No palm trees for us. No, We're just no, talking no. about Florida. No. All right. We have so much to talk about the next few days. Keep it tuned to WTNH.com and News 8. Stay safe, everyone, and have a wonderful Sunday.